Alright, here we are. So, as you can see here, I have everything, all the missions are done. All I'm doing here is making more power. Can you see this M thing over here? This uh, methane thingamabobber that's over here, this guy here. I don't know where to get methane from. And that thing needs methane. There are some geysers over here. In this area here, there's a geyser that puts out methane. So I put one of them there to see if uh, it'll draw directly from the geyser because I don't know how, 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 how that works. So anyway, yeah. Yeah, because that thing makes like 20,000 power. So the main problem I'm having right now is the power. Cause you see this uses 100, 100, 100. These guys when you upgrade them they go from 100 to 200. This one's not upgraded. These guys over here put out about uh, 25, 29, about 3000 when they're at 100% but nothing here stays at 100%. <laughs> so uh, yeah, all right. So I'm building another one over here. This is just for uh, redundancy, you know? Because as you can see right now, I got a total of 24,000 uh, power. But as you can see, it's, it goes down little by little. And the biggest problem is these guys, these three guys right here. This guy uses 25. This guy uses 5,000, and this guy uses 7,500. Just like these guys here, the refineries. When you first get it, when you first build it, it only uses 1,000. But once you upgrade it to, this, to the next level, it uses 2,000. This one, when you upgrade it to the other level, because you have to make two of them. Okay and uh it will um go up to 2500 i've upgraded one of these guys here just one of them they make like 900 to a thousand as they go down and this uh the upgrade gives uh 200 more so and um the other thing i wanted to show was as you can see here, I've built all of these guys, but there's nothing here. And there's nothing here. I got all of these. I got all of these. This is the one, the solid fuel generator. It uses Martian gas deposits to create a dependable power source, high waste, whatever, blah, blah, blah. And it doesn't work. This uh, here, the warehouse. And I got everything except there's things missing still. But this is a early access game. So it's still, but I really enjoy playing this game. So what I'm doing right now is I'm getting ready to finish this guy over here. So I have like excess power. So when the other stuff breaks, I can still, uh, uh, you know half power because every time I leave and come back there's a whole bunch of things there so I just got more <laughs> things to fix to give you all this defective equipment to come to Mars and and <laughs> but I, this guy here is supposed to have like people coming and landing here but I've yet to see anything land there you know no nah, I haven't seen anything land there and obviously the people that do land here and come here they are inside of these places and you probably never see them i would like to see you know like npcs and uh you know other npcs in the game i would like to see that okay so one of the things that i wanted to do here is I wanted to show somebody 
what I mean about looking for other places because the mission on the the uh, or the original mission for doing the stowaway is like way over here okay and that's not where you want to go I mean you don't want to there's another mission that sends you way out here I've been all the way out here I'm pretty sure you can go further because that's uh going north is where the game seems to the map seems to extend that way mostly like north and east and there's more going down south which I have been also but mostly everything is around this area but <clears throat> what I wanted to show Mr. Shredder okay see I've already been to this one here and if you come down this which is this is like going south from the base okay so you would have to you can't go directly south you have to come out through uh yeah through you have to come out through here which is where the bridge is you go down the bridge and then you come around and you go south okay so you got to go east and then south and then if you look at these guys down here which uh, you got to upgrade the sensors on your on your x18 now you see right here you got pure titanium right here that's why I told you to keep scanning look right here raw titanium there it there, there are places where it's way closer you don't have to go <laughs> You don't have to go all that way and here we got pure chromium right here pure copper But the ones that are like really good Like let's say you want to get the big vehicles Because um, you do get them for free once you finish some one of the missions you get one Then when you do the other mission you'll get another one you see these guys right here pure cobalt and pure zinc that stuff is really expensive because that's what I did in another playthrough because sometimes you reach a part in the game where the game crashes and then when you load back in it's like it's uh, you lose all your progress so yeah you can come over here and load up on this if you want to get the big truck which is the one I used to go really far out and even this stuff right here is pretty expensive and you sell it once you get your landing pad you can sell it um, let's see here more titanium here but to get to this area here you have to be able to cross level 7 and level 8 corrosive field that's why I'm saying to keep upgrading um, See, like over here is one of what people are posting on the forums that is a Russian base but I've yet to see any Russian language there uh, there's another one here yeah that's where the gold and stuff is this is where you go when you upgrade your uh, solar panels you go to this place here but anyway yeah there is um, uh, there's stuff there I mean there's a there, there's more you don't have to go all the way up there when I first did that mission for the titanium I went around this way I went around this way I tried to go through there no can't go through there I went all the way around through here all the way around all the way around all the way around and got to here but the best way to get to that one was to go straight out through here and you'll find like a little thing that you enter the, the cavern and it goes all the way around and it goes and it twists and it turns and it twists and you'll see the cavern right here and you wind up uh, through this side here and you go up to get to it this was another mission that the game wanted me to go to too but it was like what the no way there's no way to get there okay so that's what I wanted to show and uh, 
and that's uh pretty much uh everything because i got right now i don't have seven vehicles anymore because i have to do again but i do have the three main vehicles in the game which i am gonna get another x18 i got the big guy here this guy is really good for long distance i have made it through level 24 corrosive shields with this guy this guy is good because he has and when you upgrade it it can go up to almost 300 in my other playthrough i had him up to like 300 cargo so this guy is good for um uh loading him up so you could bring back stuff and uh put it away in your warehouse once you upgrade it yeah so yeah just to have stuff or else you just bring it back and leave it in there and you sell it which is what i did in my other playthrough my other playthrough i had seven vehicles because i didn't know that you get them for free once you did missions and i got this this guy here which is your normal one and i got this guy here which is all glitched out <clears throat> that one has like a hundred and a hundred and what cargo I had it up to 200 cargo but this guy is really glitched yeah that one that one I don't recommend using that one uh, so that's it that's it that's it that's it that's it for now uh, I'll catch you guys later and uh, hope you like this and uh, this is my base and yeah I had to make another oxygen because once you make these guys over here uh, you'll need I mean water uh, uh, H2O um, you have to make another one of those and you have to make another oxygen thingamabobber um, because if you don't because uh, these guys over here use a lot of oxygen this is like the, the uh, <laughs> thing that grows food and and stuff like that uh, living quarters over here and the uh, I guess it would be like the mess hall and stuff yeah those things use a lot of power <coughs> Uh, one another suggestion I can make uh, Before you build your first refinery try and have at least four of these guys built these guys here Have four of those because once you build that sucker <laughs> then Everything's gonna turn off <laughs> All right, so that's it catch y'all later